If you're looking for help fixing your Tesla Powerwall, look no further. Our comprehensive Tesla Powerwall troubleshooting guide will explain common issues, provide tips, and show you how to read your model's error codes. Troubleshooting your Powerwall. Your Powerwall may require some basic troubleshooting from time to time. Some issues can be resolved from the convenience of your home without the need for additional technician assistance. If you receive an alert, identify your issue below and follow the applicable troubleshooting instructions. You can also review your Powerwall owner documents for additional information. Gateway offline. Any of the following may indicate that your gateway is offline, leaving you unable to view your energy data in the Tesla app. The power flow screen in the app is grayed out or blank. Your gateway is making a beeping sound. The LED light on the right side of your power wall is flashing rapidly. Troubleshooting process You will need your gateway serial number, home Wi-Fi password, and a Wi-Fi enabled device tablet, smartphone, or laptop while troubleshooting. Step 1 Reset your gateway by pressing the reset button for approximately 10 seconds. Wait approximately 5 minutes for your power wall to reset. Step 2 If resetting your gateway does not resolve your issue, or if your gateway does not have a reset button, Follow the process to connect to Tesla Gateway. Meter offline. Any of the following may indicate that your meter is offline, leaving you unable to view your power flows or energy data in the Tesla app. The power flow screen in the app is grayed out or blank. Your battery storage level has been at 0% for multiple days. Note do not troubleshoot during a grid outage or in extreme weather conditions. Troubleshooting process Step 1 Reset your gateway by pressing the reset button for approximately 10 seconds. Wait approximately 5 minutes for your power wall to reset. If your gateway does not have a reset button, or if resetting your gateway does not resolve your issue, proceed with the steps below. Step 2 Turn off your solar inverter if your home is connected to a solar system. Note if you own a Tesla solar system. Follow the steps to turn off your solar inverter. After selecting your inverter model, select other as the error code, and then complete the first troubleshooting step by turning off the DC disconnect dial. Step 3 Turn off your power wall using the power switch on the right side of your power wall. Step 4 Turn off all power wall breakers. Locate the electrical panel that your power wall is connected to. Then switch its breaker to the off position. Your power wall breaker is typically located at the bottom of your main panel and labeled battery or power wall. Step 5 Turn off the main service disconnect. Locate the main service disconnect that connects your home to your utilities grid. Then switch it to the off position. This is typically located either in the main electrical panel or the sub-panel. Note turning off the main service disconnect will shut off power for your home. Step 6 Wait no less than 5 minutes to allow your system to fully reboot. Step 7 Turn on the main service disconnect. And switch all power wall breakers to the on position. Turn on your power wall using the power switch. And then turn on your solar inverter. Note it may take up to 24 hours for the change to reflect in the app. Breaker open. The following may indicate that your breaker is open, leaving your power wall unable to store energy. You receive a breaker open alert in the app. The LED light on the right side of your power wall is not turning on. Note do not troubleshoot if there are any signs of heat damage, smoke, burning smell, or any other signs of burning to the breaker box. Reach out to customer support if you detect heat damage. 